Michael and Shabin. Marriage is a covenant of faith and trust between a man and a woman. It requires openness of life and thought, freedom from doubt and suspicion, and commitment to speak the truth in love to one another. Marriage is also a covenant of hope that endures all things, and in which both husband and wife commit themselves to interpret each other's behavior with understanding and compassion, and never give up trying to communicate with each other. Marriage, therefore, is a covenant of love in which both husband and wife take upon themselves the concerns of each other as they love and care for one another. Do you both come freely and without reservation, desiring to commit yourselves to one another in this covenant of marriage? Yes. So yes. Say we do. Here we go. Michael, will you have Janine to be your wife, to live together after God's ordinance in the covenant of marriage? Will you love her, comfort her, honor and keep her in sickness and in health, and forsaking all others, be faithful to her so long as you both shall live? If so, I will with the help of God. I will with the help of God. Janine, will you have Michael to be your husband? To live together after God's ordinance and the covenant of marriage. Will you love him, comfort him, honor and keep him in sickness and in health? And forsaking all others, be faithful to him so long as you both shall live. So, I will with the help of God. Often marriage is viewed as the union of two persons. In reality, it's much broader. Marriage is joining together of two families. Therefore, as your lives are also affected by the commitment being made today, you, the families of Michael and Janine, offer your prayerful blessing and loving support to this marriage. If so, so you do. And you, all the family and friends gathered here, pledge your support and encouragement to the covenant commitment which Janine and Michael are making today. Dear God, hear our pledges encouraging and supporting this union of Michael and Janine. Bless us as we offer our prayerful and loving support to their marriage. Bless them as they pledge their lives to each other. The faith in you and in each other, may this couple always bear witness to the reality of the love to which we witness this day. May their love continue to grow. And may it be a true reflection of your love for us all, through Jesus Christ. Amen. Now the bride's brothers will read from 1 Corinthians. <laughs> Love does not insist on its own way. It is not irritable or resentful. It does not rejoice at wrong, but rejoices in the right. Love bears all things, believes all things, hopes all things, endures all things. Love never ends. So faith, hope, love abide. These three. But the greatest of these is love.
in joy and in sorrow. So long as we both show. As long as we both show. This is my song about. This is my song about. Do you want to give myself to you? Janine, I give myself to you. To be your husband. To be your husband. I promise to love and sustain you. I promise to love and sustain you. In the covenant of marriage. In the covenant of marriage. From this day forward. From this day forward. In sickness and in health. In sickness and in health. In plenty and in health. In plenty and in health. In joy and in sorrow. In joy and in sorrow. So long as we both show love. So long as we both show love. This is my song of love. This is my song of love. Michael and Janine have exchanged rings to symbolize their love. In all ages, among all peoples, the ring has been a symbol of that which is measureless, and thus a symbol of your measureless, boundless devotion. A ring has neither beginning nor ending, so your commitment should also be unending. And the sign and seal of your commitment will be your rings. Gracious God, by these symbols of covenant promise, Remind Janine and Michael of your encircling love and unending faithfulness, that in all their life together they may know joy and peace in one another. Send your blessing upon these two whom we bless in your name, that they, living faithfully together, may surely perform and keep the vow and covenant between them and they. Janine and Michael, you have committed yourselves to each other in this joyous and sacred covenant. Become one. Fulfill your vows. Love and serve God. Honor Christ and each other. And rejoice in the power of the Holy Spirit. For as much as Janine and Michael have consented together in holy wedlock, and have witnessed the same before God in this company, and thereto have given and pledged their faith, each to the other, and have declared the same by the giving and receiving of rings and by joining hands, I pronounce that they are husband and wife in the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. Those whom God has joined together, let no one put asunder. I believe in history.